this video, I'm going to show you how to use AI to write a travel request email. The first thing you're going to need to do is go to your preferred browser. I'm using Incognito for the sake of this video. In the search bar, you're going to type in chat.openai.com. It's going to prompt you to log in or sign up. If you don't have an account, choose to sign up. If you already have an account, go ahead and log in. Once you get logged in, it's going to have you acknowledge a few items. So today we're going to be using the chat GPT 3.5. There's also GPT 4. 4 is paid for, I don't use it. The 3.5 has uh, been effective and efficient for everything that I've needed so far. To get this email going, you're going to go down to send a message and you're going to type in exactly what you want. For us, and for the sake of this, um, we're going to put write an email requesting approval and traveling to an upcoming marketing conference in Austin, Texas to obtain knowledge and marketing automation in one paragraph. So we have what we wanted to do, write an email requesting approval. The conference is in Austin. Um, we have what it's for. It's going to be to obtain knowledge and marketing automation and in one paragraph. The reason why we have one paragraph in there is because AI likes to give you several paragraphs for an email. And I know I don't like to read several paragraphs at work and neither does your supervisor. The only other thing I might add in here um, is the date. So upcoming marketing conference in Austin, Texas, um, August, August has passed at this point, not that it matters, but November 3rd through 6th, 2023. And we're going to hit enter. And so it's, it came up with something nice. It has a subject, request, to, uh, request for approval, attendance at marketing automation conference at Austin, Texas. It puts the dates in parentheses. Dear Jenny, I hope this email finds you well. I'm writing to seek your approval for my attendance at the upcoming marketing automated automation conference taking place in Austin, Texas from November 3rd to 6th. Mm. I don't like how that looks, but we can always change that to a dash, right? So a member of the marketing team, I believe that this conference offers a unique opportunity to gain valuable knowledge and insights into the latest trends and advancements in marketing automation. The event's comprehensive agenda and renowned speakers promise to equip me with cutting edge strategies, tools, and techniques to enhance our marketing efforts and optimize our automation processes. I'm confident that this investment in my professional development will yield significant benefits for our department and the company as a whole. Thank you for considering my request and I look forward to your favorable response. Kind regards or best regards. So what you're going to do with this, um, first off, if you don't like it, you can always hit regenerate. What you're going to do with this is you're going to copy and paste into your email. You're going to take all this, well, from dear manager, all the way down. And you're going to hit control C and then go into your um, email and paste it in there and then you'll change some items like this and you know you'll put your manager supervisor uh, the approvee's name in there you'll put your signature down at the bottom and then you'll come back and you can always copy and paste this subject and put it in the subject line if for some reason you do not like this you can always hit regenerate and it'll come up with something uh, within the same realm but a little different cool thing about AI is if this is irrelevant and this is not in my case but a majority of the time AI will go and pull information from that relevant so if you provide the dates the location and the name of the event it's going to go pull keynote speakers uh, continue education and development courses that they may have so that's something very unique with AI I'm not good at articulating this kind of stuff I love to go to conferences, but I don't know how to articulate this all the time. So AI helps me do that. Drop in the comments 
how you use AI for business.